Well, Gather, another run out for the lads, the penultimate pre-season friendly. What did you make of it? I thought that we uh, we worked very hard. You know, we started the game slowly, but we grew into it, and then we played some good stuff. Uh, we need to obviously be very much more clinical. Uh, we had a lot of chances, but overall, it was about the fitness tonight. Um, you know, and 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 getting the boys through 90 minutes. Yeah, was that the, the key aspect? Because we have a split squad. So there's a young squad that's gone to Cheltenham. You've only got a man of six, 16 man squad here, 14 senior pros to choose from. So was it all about getting as much into the legs as you could tonight? Yeah, 100. percent Listen, we didn't want to lose the game, of course, you know. But um, you know, I've learned a lot about the team as well tonight, which is good for me. Um, yeah, the most disappointing thing is we didn't take our chances. Um, but you know, it's working process, progress. We know where we are. You know, lots of hard work still on the training field to do. And, um, you know, we're, we're still in a good place. Yeah, it looked like a little bit of a change of system. Bakuna and, and Pepe as well, up ahead of uh, or alongside Scott Hogan. Is that something you can have a look at during these pre-season friendlies? And you need a, verse, a bit of versatility in there. Yeah, definitely. And, that, you know, friendlies, that's what it's all about. You know, we changed our shape uh, today, the first time uh, in the last three games. You know, again, I, I've learned a few things from that. And... Uh, yeah, this is what this stage of the season is all about. You know, we're going to be ready for Luton, um, and uh, yeah, it's all about learning and developing the, the boys. Yeah, do the principles stay the same though? Regardless, everyone can talk about shapes and systems and formations, but us as a team, do the principles stay the same regardless? Yeah, one hundred percent. You know, we're all about hard work. We're all about good shape. We're hard to break down. Um, you know, all the stuff off the ball that we need to do to, to make us competitive. And, and tonight, um, you know, apart from uh, a couple of the set pieces, I think we, I think we did that. You know, um, again, I learnt a lot about the, the group today, which is good for me. You know, it's been going well. Um, and tonight, a little setback, but there's no problems. This is pre-season. That's what it's all about. Yeah, first involvement for a couple of players. Sustin Trusty caught the eye. I know you've been asked about it by the local press as well. What did you make of his, his performance? I thought he was excellent. That's his first game for the club, first game for three or four weeks. You know, I thought he was magnificent. And uh, if that's his first game, you know, there's a lot more to come. You know, he's, he did everything that he wanted to. He's very athletic. And uh, I think we're lucky to have him. Yeah, you spoke about the number of chances we created, particularly in that second half. Is it just a cutting edge? Is it a ruthless streak? What is it that was missing? Yeah, just that, that cutting edge. You know, we, We've been scoring goals in pre-season, which has been great. Tonight it hasn't happened, but you know, there's lots of hard work, as I said, ahead. You know, and that's on the training field. You know, and, and that's the only way we can we can score more goals and how we and the only way we can defend better, you know. So as I say, pre season's pre season and um and we're looking forward to, to Saturday now. Yeah, four injured lads still on the sidelines. How are they shaping up ahead of Saturday? But more importantly with Luton on the horizon. Yeah, they're coming. They're they're getting fitter. Uh, I think we might have uh, Juki and, and Friendy back at, by the end of the week, which will be a massive plus to the squad. Uh, two good characters, and um, you know we'll just take it from there. Yeah, ten days to go now. Are the lads where you'd like them to be? Yeah, definitely. You know, we're, the, 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 there's a buzz in the camp. Definitely. Uh, you know, there's a real confidence out there in the camp as well. Disappointing tonight, but there's lots of positives, lots of good things to take away from it. And, um, you know, we're, we're in a good place as a squad, definitely.